Yo, what is up guys, and welcome back to our Heart Gold Randomizer Nuzlocke. Jax here, and we are going to get straight into the swing of things. Uh, we're going to check out our party. Um, so, I was just having a look through the abilities before, and these guys have some pretty good abilities. Gluttony on Spooks, which isn't too bad. We got Nami, the Pure Power uh, Skip Bloom. We got Dewey, the Levitating Belt Sprout. Dobbs with Marvel Scale, which uh, ups its defense if there's a status problem. And then we have our Egg, which is nowhere near close to hatching, unfortunately. So we're going to get straight into the swing of things and uh, try and rocket through onto the next route. I'll be interested to see what our next encounter is, uh, but I think we have a few battles to do as well. Alright, so down through here should be the new route. Route 32. Alright, so is this person going to battle us? Wait up! What's the hurry? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. We got the Miracle Seed. Unfortunately, that's not randomized. That'd be very good if it was. Alright, a Skarmory. Skarmory would be pretty cool. Um, how much is Lick gonna do? Lick is not very effective. Alright, um, Spooks is cool and all, but he ain't gonna be doing a lot of damage, so I might just uh, switch him from out in front, maybe train up some of the other ones. Uh, what do we got? Quick attack. This will take a while. Not as long as I thought, that's good. Um, let's switch it up. What are we going to go with? Maybe put an army out in front. Oh, of course I would. Alrighty. Looks like we have a trainer battle. Hopefully Nami can take him alright. Alright, oh it sends out Ninkata. Risky grass going against a uh, a bug type. But we should be fine. Look at that. Smashed him. Ooh, close to the next level. A Linoon. Well, that was pretty strong. Whoa. Alright, I knew my defense dropped, but I didn't realize that it would get that close to going down. Wow, I almost leveled up twice from that. That's pretty good. Alright, um, well, new Pokemon out in front now, because otherwise Nami is going to go down very easily. Uh, let's put Dewey out in front, but we'll be ready to switch him out whenever is needed. A Destiny Knot. Fair enough. Alright, you accept my challenge. Sends out a whooper. This is good if I have like vine whoop or something. Oh, perfect. Oh, super effective. Down in one shot. That's what we like to see. Uh, no. I don't want your phone number. She asked me again, really? Alrighty. A few fishermen over here. Now, these are risky battles because I'm pretty sure they have a 15. And if the 15 ends up being a uh, legendary... Oh my god, really? Alright, uh, I think Vine Whip should be super effective. Yeah. And a crit hit as well. Use Sandstorm. That's fine. Vine Whip takes down the T-Tar. Ooh, Dewey's level 10. 11! That XP though! Woo! It's almost halfway through 11 as well. And a Corefish. Oh ho ho! Dewey putting in the hard work, man. I like it. I think Dewey has to get to level 25 before it can evolve though, which is pretty nuts. It does have Levitate though, so it's not the end of the world, but because uh, it's a good ability. This is the difficult battle. Alright, so we got four Pokemon to deal with. Oh, 
That was a crit hit, I think. Um, over to the bow toy. I should be able to take this down very easy as well with the vine whip. Probably going to run out of PP soon on uh, vine whip. Smooch him, another level 5. Oh, I'm up to level 13 now. Uh, what's it sending out? Pachirisu. A level 15 Pachirisu is probably one of the best things I could have hoped for. Uh oh. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Dewey went from being like one of the weakest members on the team to one of the strongest in like two battles. Let's just check out the uh, team very quickly. So Dewey's 14, Spooks is 13, Dobbs is 16, and Nami is 11. Um, that ain't bad. I'll switch Dobbs to out in front though. Just because... I feel as though we're going to uh, need someone tough up front for this next battle. So only got one, it's an Ambipom at a level 10. Um, let's go for the quick attack. Uh, don't start this. I don't want to miss every attack. Oh, that's alright. There we go. No. You can't have my phone number. Alright, quick battle, and I think there might be a Pokemon Center down here based off of my first playthrough before I died. But let's see. An Osaring is pretty strong, especially with that Fury Swipe, so that ain't gonna be good. Alright, down goes Osaring, and Dobbs is level 17. Helping Hand, no thanks. Give up on Helping Hand. Alrighty. This person want a battle? Yeah. No, he wants to sell me something for like a million. One million dollars. Alright, we are at the center, healed up, and ready to go. Alright, is there anything through here? Couldn't see anything on the ground. Oh well. Um, let's go up through here. Another Skarmory. Let's get rid of this Skarmory nice and quick. And then we can be on our merry way. I'll probably start running away from them now. Alright, we got Thrash. I don't think that will be really useful. Um, let's have a look quickly though. Wrong section, into the dag. All right. Uh, we've got Thrash and Powder Snow. Powder Snow, power 40, accuracy 100. Can anyone learn it? Uh, no, they can't. All right, so that is an interesting. Thrash on the other hand, 90 and 100. Spooks can learn it. I think it's probably best that we give this. I mean, look, is probably good to keep for the moment. I might get rid of it eventually, but at least that uh, gives us a good attacking move. Um, oh, TMs disappear in this game. I forgot about that. All right. Let's see how we do get into this item. An armor fossil! Yay! That's like a free encounter. Pretty sure that's the exact same spot of grass that I got stuck in last time. Alright, down goes right down. Alright, this Picnicker only has one Pokemon. Should be able to... Ooh! They managed to last the one shot. Alright, is there anything up here quickly? 
Doesn't look like it. We just took a different path to be able to get to where we wanted to go. Alrighty. Let's go and heal up just very quickly. And then we can uh, head into the cave and get a brand new encounter. <coughs> I don't think I should be able to make it to the uh, next city in this part. I'm not going to try and uh, take too long or anything like that. Alright. Train a battle. The bird keeper that has a pupitar. Um... Ooh, if I had got that five shot, that would have been awesome. Dobbs is up to level 18. Ooh, should we have a bell sprout off? <laughs> I want to see what uh, Haunter can do with Thrash. It's pretty strong. Let's switch out to Nami. Accidentally click splash there. Whoops. Should be fine though. Down goes Blissey. Should get a decent amount of experience for that. Poison powder instead of splash. Sure you can. Alright, well that was an easy battle. Uh, we don't have Rock Smash yet, so we can't go down there, but this is a new encounter in the Union Cave. I am excited. Let's see what we get. Um, I've got to make sure that I have someone. Uh, let's put Spooks up in front, because we can put it to sleep, and then I can switch to someone else if need be. What is it going to be? It's not a Legendary. It's... Skun Tank. I won't sleep on him. He is a good mon. Uh, poison typing could be uh, uh, could be very useful. I sort of do have a uh, few already on the team though. So okay, we finally got the hypnosis off. Uh, I think I might just throw some balls just to see first. Ooh, almost got it. And that one broke out straight away. Come on, Pokeball, let's go. One, two. Break out, come on. Uh, didn't even realize that this man woke up. Come on. One, two, three. Yes! We got ourselves a skun tank. Alrighty. I am going to call him Sneaky after my card opening up buddy at Sneaky Evo. Uh, so, well, it'd help if I could actually spell. How did I forget that? A hey. sneaky. Alrighty, welcome to the team at Sneaky. Um, I guess we should probably switch him out up in front. Then we can start to get a few level ups from this. All right, a hey, Munchlax. Um. Munchlax is a thick boy, so he ain't gonna go down easy. This guy, this Munchlax had leftovers. That's very fitting. Jesus. A super repel. A seeking. Uh, Dewey, out you come. Alright, 
level six already. That's good. That's gun tank. Oh yeah, because whatever's at the front of the party, and because I'm training up skin tank at the moment. I'm just hoping that it doesn't get like arena trapped or something like that, because that's gonna suck. Uh, I don't have any flying type moves or anything like that, so I'm just gonna have to overpower it. Yep, with one scratch, that'll do. Alright, I probably won't explore all of this downstairs area here. Just because I can't be bothered. But we'll get these two items. A rare candy! I will take that. I'll probably save it for a rainy day. A Chikorita would have been very nice as well. Oh, it's not doing anything now. And goodbye, Chikorita. Senor Chikorita. Alright. Got a few more battles and then we'll be out of this cave. I do like it how, like, there's caves where you can just get through nice and quick. And then there's other caves that, uh, take a little while to, uh, get through but like what I mean by that is uh, you can explore them a little bit more without having to um, like progress through the story really really slowly through them just having an annoying cave like that which I think if there was a bit more story in the caves then that would be good but when there's no story behind what you're doing it's a little bit frustrating but thank god for the speed up button um, should be able to take this down in two more hits. It won't be able to kill me. Hey, hey level eight, sneaky! I didn't even see what's coming out, so. Hey, Grimer. Almost got it down in one. Um. I didn't see what's coming out again, because I am just holding down the speed up button, which is silly of me, but I just want to get through this battle quickly, and I don't feel as though I'm a, I'm a uh, massive risk at the moment. Uh, what does Dewey want to learn? He wants to learn Poison Powder. You can forget growth and learn that. Alright, Hiker Russell, thank you very much. Alright, uh, we have a problem with the ROM again. Save very quickly, and then I'll have to restart the ROM. We'll be right back. <clears throat> Alrighty, we are back, continuing on our little journey through the cave. What's this encounter? A matang! Alright, that's pretty cool. Uh, poison gas. And it doesn't affect it because it is a poison type. Great. It's going to cause a lot of damage to itself with takedown. Which I'm happy about. It's doing a decent amount to me as well though. Alright. Let's verse this flamethrower dude. Fire breathe the bill. Alright. I missed. Great. Well, let's take it down. One more scratch should do. Done with the crit hit. Alright, level 9. I think he said bell toy. Oh, ghastly. Close enough. He missed, and I win. All of these Pokemon are fairly low level so far. Alright, Red Flute. I'm not actually sure what the Red Flute does. Well, let's have a look. Battle items. Where is battle items? Red Flute. A Red Flute made from blue and glass. Its melody snaps a single Pokemon out of infatuation. Alright, interesting. 
I suppose we can use that if it uh, comes down to a dire situation. Alright, there is an item up here that we will go and get. Uh, we should be able to take a seal, right? Alright, uh, nope. Let's switch out. And Dubs can finish it off. Ah, of course Dubs got poisoned. Alright, um, Pokemon. Switch with Dewey. Dewey can jump out the front. Alright, a Dragon Fang. Alright, a Chingaling. I would love to get one of these in uh, Pokemon Go. But they are very uncommon, so hard to get. Alright, Dewey, come on. Let's get Dewey up there. I think it's either 18 or 25. I can't remember what level. There's no item over here, unfortunately. Scum tank is back again. And down it goes. A schnobble. Alright, down that one goes. We get to level 16. That's what I like to see. Got a seal, which I think we can take down in one. Yep. Easy. A mental herb. I would rather a master ball. Alright, route 33. This is a new route. Um, this person just wants to have a little chat. I don't want to really chat at the moment. I would prefer to heal up my Pokemon. Ah, uh, of course. This is going to suck if this person has strong Pokemon. Oh, of course. Um, sleep powder then. Anything? Alright, now that we've put it to sleep, we can use wrap. I'm the same gender, so it can't uh, infatuate me in love. Alright, Rap is just going to slowly get rid of this thing. It took a while, but it's finally down. I have no clue what this dude is sending out. Hey Lugia, great! That's exactly what I wanted to say. At least I put it to sleep straight away. Um, oh, super effective. Oh, no. Of course, I hurt myself in confusion. You better not get hurt by this poison. No! We're gonna lose du We lost- Oh my god, this Lugia! Come on, man! That's annoyed me. It would have been fine. This Lugia wasn't doing anything to me. <sighs> Getting rid of me, look. No, you can go away. You're a meanie. You're a mean head. 
I can't believe that we just lost our starter. We lost Dobbs because of the stupidest thing in the world. Alright. Well, we made it to the Pokemon Center. I'm going to go back and get the uh, encounter very quickly. And then we can call it there. We'll be replacing Dobbs on the team. Uh, deposit the Pokemon. I'm sorry, Dobbs. 18 is my dead box. Goes along with the Surskit. I haven't forgot Surskit was dead. Alright. Well, that sucks. A lot. Alright, so this person is just selling Pokeballs as well. Um, let's buy 11 of them. We've got money. Let's go and get this encounter. Hopefully we can get some power. We've asked a Lugia near here, so hopefully we can uh, find a legendary or something. Although if it is something like that, I'm going to be a little bit uh, salty. Because I just got rid of mean look. <gasps> Quilava! Yes, buddy! Come on! Alright. Um... Still scared by this, like hurting it so much that it'll kill it. I would love to be able to hit this thing with sleep powder. How annoyed would I be if I didn't have sleep uh, speed up? All right. One, two, three. Got it! Straight up! Alright, um... What are we going to call this man? I'm going to call him Pyro. The next, uh... Next one, next part, I'm going to look at uh, all comments on different videos. And, uh, we'll choose some, uh people to name some Pokemon after based off of people that comment on the videos. Um, if you guys would like to get named after a Pokemon, then uh, make sure that you leave a comment down below. And I'll try my best to uh, remember to name the Pokemon after you guys. Alright, so that's a pretty good finish. Um, we managed to finish up with this Quilaba. Um, unfortunately, we lost our starter in Dobbs. Um, but I want to have a quick look and see what Pyro has as the ability. He has Gluttony as well, which is, encourages the early use of a Hellberry, same as the Haunter. Um, but that's not bad, because they're both not at their final evolution stages yet. I'm pretty sure that Spooks is alright for, uh, um, like, evolving. I don't know what level he'll evolve at, but, uh, yeah, should be alright. Um, then we got our, uh, Sneaky who prevents the Pokemon from becoming confused. All right, that's all right. Uh, pure power and levitate on these guys. That is a pretty good team to start off with, guys. We're about to hit the second gym. Um, usually a fire type would help us a lot, but because the gym leader just has whatever he wants, then uh, yeah, it's just what we have to deal with. So thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you next time. Peace.